All right, for number 19, we need a definite, we just want to write a definite integral that represents the total amount of water leaking out of a tank on a two hour time interval. So time is from zero to two, the rate of leakage is R of T and DT. When I integrate that, it will be the total amount of the water that leaked. And part B says shade the region. Well, the region is all of the area bound by the function and the t-axis on the interval from 0 to 2, so that shaded region. Then they want the right-hand sum with eight rectangles, so that means each one quarter, so this high, this high, let's see if I could just draw in the corners of them here. Then I'm going to have to estimate the y values go, bring it down, there we go. Okay, so I'm not going to draw in the full rectangles because my lines wouldn't be very straight. So each rectangle is going to be one quarter wide. We'll go with these hash marks here. So one quarter wide, and then we just need to put in all the right hand y values of the function. So we're going to have to estimate, do our best. Um, I'll say two plus maybe 1.75, not 1.75, 1.875 maybe, plus 1.75, plus this guy comes in at maybe 1.6. Uh, I'm not even sure that they're asking us to do this. Now that I'm reading the question more closely, they're not asking us to find this right-hand sum. They're asking us if we were to find this right-hand sum, would it be an overestimate or an underestimate? And I think you could see here, because of these gaps, these are going to be underestimates because we're not including all of the area. So the answer is an underestimate, but the true reason why is because the function r of t is decreasing. And that's all you have to write to confirm.